Our next question from the grade nine students is, what is the plan to end homelessness? Will you be able to commit to the 2020 goal? Well, I'm gonna spend a little more time on this question because it's not gonna be a great answer for, for you, but I think I'll be bringing some awareness and enlightenment and seeding a new idea into your minds for the future. My first answer will go to the second half of the question. I do not support, I do not support the commitment of the 2020 goal. Now back to your first question, what is the plan to end homelessness? Well, my end is this, we have a problem. We need to stop labeling people homeless. Okay, solution. Here's the story. Met with a fella down on our uh, Edmonton uh, inner city, lives down there, and he likes to be referred to as a street community individual. So this is where I think in my mind, yeah, I got to change too. And the problem is that a lot of politicians and a lot of storefront politicians, I'm a people mayoral. I've been doing this for 30 years and I advocate for the person not for the political vote. So I probably won't get a vote on this, but I'm hoping to open a new trail to a new mind that we have to stop labeling people homeless, okay? Because some people prefer to live in the, in the way that they live. And that's an individual choice. We are in a society where we're individuals. And a lot of people like to use the term homelessness in order to get favor through organizations, funding, so on and whatnot. I do not support that. But I will support shelter, food security, and support community services for individuals in need. I leave you with this. In your mind, I open your mind a little, I hope. Think, what does it mean to be homeless? Because there are many people that I've spoken to in my life that said they were freer living in their car and selling pizza, 73 pizza. I mean, it's kind of funny. I don't mind the pizza. But the thing of it is, you guys, now that fella is in their 70s and says he never felt free. He doesn't feel free anymore. He feels homeless. See, so there you go. It's a definition of term. And I hope I've opened your mind to the awareness that some people use this and have been using this globally for years. We have never, ever solved homelessness, the term homelessness in global history. So whoever is bringing forth a 2020 platform, not supporting it, won't be signing in on it, not there. But I do believe in supporting people in need and uh, supporting uh, community street people in whatever choices they make. So I hope I've said a lot there and I thank you guys uh, at uh, St. Michael's there. I call it St. Michael's, Father Michael's, okay. Because I'm sure a lot of you are saints down there, and that's great. Um, you know, it's a hard question, and it's even hard for me to answer, so I might come off a little bit shaky and nervous on that one because I'm starting something in my own heart that tells me that we need to open our mind to people using homelessness people to gather political gain, and I'm not for that. So thank you again, you guys down at Father uh, Michael's School, grade 9 students, and I wish you all the best in your futures, and keep on rocking.